We've all heard about hydrogen, but what do we actually need it for? First of all, hydrogen is the most abundant element in the universe. You probably remember seeing it on the periodic table at school. It's a flammable gas and is already used for rocket fuel. Hydrogen is more and more often being promoted to generate electricity, heating, power for industry and even vehicles, as it's seen as a clean alternative to oil and gas. But what makes it clean? As a fuel, hydrogen emits no climate-warming carbon dioxide. Simply put, it reacts with oxygen in a fuel cell. The result? Water and energy. But there is a catch. Extracting hydrogen is energy-intensive, but it can be renewable if powered sustainably. About 96% of the world's hydrogen currently comes from gas and coal. Only about 1% is considered green, coming from renewable sources like wind and solar. The aim is to increase this number. Germany plans to allocate 4.6 billion euros to finance green hydrogen projects. The US plans to invest 9.5 billion in green hydrogen projects as part of the bipartisan infrastructure law. Businesses are also trying to keep up. Germany's biggest steelmaker, ThyssenKrupp, for example, is working on a hydrogen-powered blast furnace. The Dutch BDR Ferme Group develops hydrogen boilers. Stuttgart-based H2 Fly is testing liquid hydrogen to power airplanes. Daimler Truck is testing hydrogen trucks in Germany. The world's first hydrogen-powered passenger train was launched in Germany in 2018. It has been successfully operating on various routes in Germany, and Frankfurt added hydrogen buses to its public transport system in 2022. When it comes to hydrogen cars, companies like Toyota, Hyundai and Honda have been leading the charge for years. Swiss startup HydroRide Europe is even producing hydrogen bikes. But hydrogen also has its downsides. Building the infrastructure for hydrogen production, storage and distribution is costly and complex. Also, hydrogen needs to be stored under high pressure or at very low temperatures, which requires specialized and expensive equipment. Plus, there are safety concerns. Hydrogen is highly flammable and requires careful handling. Tell us what you think about hydrogen.